What's up, my beautiful Scorpios? What's up, twins? I hope all you guys are doing well. So, this is going to be a twin flame reading, and I'm going to start from my energy deck and see what messages Spirit has for you guys, okay? All right, let's get to it. What messages do you have for my Scorpios today, Spirit? What kind of energy is around them at this time on this twin flame journey? Okay, so the first card that came out is so confused. So, Scorpio, your twin could be very confused at this time or this could be your energy maybe your twin is going through a lot you know they're trying to figure out exactly what this connection is or they could be trying to figure out how they're going to get back in their scorpio's life or scorpio this could be you you could be confused you could be trying to figure out you know what's going to happen on this twin flying journey you know should you wait for your twin or do you really want to be with your twin have you healed are you looking looking for new love so both of you guys could be in a confused state of mind right now. Some of my Scorpios, your twin could be a Libra, or you could be dealing with a Libra. So this Libra could be the one that's feeling so confused right now. Maybe they're not knowing what to do when it comes to you and this twin flying connection. All right, let's see what other messages Spirit has for you guys. What messages do you have for my Scorpios today, Spirit, on this twin flying connection? Okay. Then we have plan hard to get. So I feel like, okay, I feel like Scorpio, your twin could be feeling confused because in the past, this person was used to coming like in and out of your life. You know, they were not consistent in your life. They would ghost your life. You know, you would hear from this person one month and then you may not talk to this motherfucker for another three, four months, right? So I feel like now that you're kind of out of the energy of like being in and out, you don't want someone who's going to be like in and out of your life. You want somebody who's going to be consistent. You want stability. So I feel like now this person could have reached out to you recently in the past. And now that you're not kind of falling for the same shit that you used to, you know, whatever games or whatever lines that your twin fed you, it was like, you ain't with that shit no more. You looking for some new shit. So I feel like this person feels like you're playing hard to keep because now you're not falling for the bullshit that you used to fall for, okay? And this is someone who is not financially stable. So this person, if your finances are looking good right now, Scorpio, this person could be feeling like, Maybe you want to deal. You don't want to deal with them because you know their finances are not good. Or this person could be trying to hide from you that right now, you know their finances are looking good right now. And this person is gonna be begging. This person is gonna be begging you, Scorpio, for another chance. This person may be begging you for some type of financial assistance. This person may be begging you to have sex. This person is just gonna be in a begging energy. But I feel like this person is confused, and that's what's gonna to lead to this begging because you change, Scorpio. You feel. Or you're in the process of healing and you're no longer want to deal with this person. Like I said, it could be this Libra or someone that has strong Libra placements in your in their chart. But this is making this person confused now, you know? They don't know what the hell to do. All right, let's pull up from the Jing and Yang and see what's popping. What messages do you have for my Scorpios? Okay. So the first card we have here is who you with. So this person could be feeling like you could be dealing with someone else. And that's why you may be, they, that's why they feel like you're playing hard to get. So they don't be like, you know, if this person made a hit you up with some little page conversation, be like, you know, who you with? What you been up to? What you got going on? So I feel like this person feels like you could be dealing with someone else. That's why you're playing hard to get. Remember earlier I said this is someone who was in and out of your life, this is of your life, not your life. <laughs> this is someone who was in and out of your life. They were not, they didn't provide any stability, you know, for you. And I feel like this is one reason why you were like, uh-uh, you, you, you chose yourself first. Because in the past, you could have been putting this person first. But now, you want to put yourself first. And then we have, I really don't know, I really don't want to tell you the truth. So, Scorpio, this could be your twin here. You could be knowing that your twin, this Libra, or air sign, or just whoever that you could be dealing with, you could know that your twin may have not been honest with you in the past. There could have been some questions or things that you've asked your twin, and this motherfucker did not want to tell the truth. And I feel like they're, they're one of the reasons they don't want to tell the truth because this person has a lot of a lot of pride. And it will hurt their pride. It will hurt them, I feel like, to their damn soul to have to apologize for some shit or to have to tell some truth about some shit that they feel like they shouldn't have to tell you. You know what I'm saying? Let's see here. What message do you have for my Scorpio today, Spirit? 
Then we have, can I come and see you? So this person could be messaging you guys here in the near future if they haven't already, but this person could be wanting to come see you. I feel like they think if they see you face to face, like maybe that will change your mind, like how you feel about them, you know, looking into this person's eyes because this could be someone that I always tell, you know, you can tell them you ain't fucking with them or this and that, and this person look into your eyes and tell that you still love them. So I feel like this person is wanting to see you face to face. They want to look into your eyes to really see if you still fucking with them or not. Okay. Oh, okay. So the truth is, we got a couple cards that came up. So the one of the truths could be is this person never planned on catching feelings for you. So this could have been someone you know you were just having a little fun, you know, just getting your little rocking your socks off or getting your socks rocked off or whatever, you know. And this person really never planned on catching feelings. Like they were going to do you like they did everybody else. You know, this is someone who probably randomly meets people here and there, whether it be at work, out and about, you know, they throw their little game, let them get a phone number, go fuck them, and then shit, leave them alone. If it's good, they may go back a second time, but then that's it. This is like a no strings attached type person. But when you came along, Scorpio, this person fucked around, and they caused some feelings for your ass, and they was not planning on doing it, and that's why this person ran from you. I feel like they ran from love, and they ran from you because... You, they weren't supposed to catch feelings, Scorpio. They were just supposed to be fucking and doing you like they did everybody else. But you could not be done like everybody else. And this person could want to tell you or don't want to tell you that when you guys were fucking around, this person was married with children. This person still could be married with children right now. Or this person could be in the process of, of possibly trying to, um, maybe trying to get a divorce. And then we have, what would you do if I showed up at your house unexpectedly? So y'all swing on the lost their goddamn mind, Scorpio. This motherfucker talking about now. <laughs> they feel like now because they so confused and they feel like you playing hard to get Scorpio. This motherfucker saying, fuck it. I'm just going to come up to Scorpio house. I'm just going to go to Scorpio house and beg. And if I go to their house, they can't say no to me if I beg and pop up at their house. All right, Scorpio, that's all I got for you. If something here resonates, please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to my channel. And until next time, twins. Stay blessed.